everybody, it's Heather from Midwest Aftermarket. Today we've got the installation of the ICI Magnum RT Step Bars for this 2015 Chevy 1500 Silverado Double Cab. These are going to run for $394.99 on our website, and the part number is RTS14CH. So you're going to get both the driver and the passenger side. This, we've got the driver's side laid out for you just so you guys could see what's going on. You've got your hardware. You do get that in just a big old bag, and it's all mixed up, so we kind of went through it and organized it a little bit. So there's the hardware. You've got all of your bracketry right here. Then they also give you this protective pad that's going to go on the front of your step just for extra protection. And for you Duramax guys, you're also going to get this bracket that's going to help out with your DEF tank. Now let's get the brackets put onto the steps. You're going to grab a bolt and throw a washer on it. Feed it through the underside of the step in the designated spot. Grab your bracket and get it lined up. As you can see, there are holes on both the steps and the brackets for the hardware. Here, throw another washer on the other side of the bracket, grab a lock washer, and then the nut, and hand tighten. Here, we didn't grab a socket or anything because it will be easier to install these up underneath the truck if the brackets aren't tightened down completely. You'll definitely want to do that afterwards. Now, let's grab another bolt and repeat the same process. Each bracket gets two bolts in the necessary hardware. Give me a minute so I can get the rest of these brackets onto the steps. Now that we got the brackets on, let's climb under the truck and locate where the steps are going to mount up. Each hole will have a factory cap that you will need to pop out. No need to keep these. ICI provides you clips that you will lock into those holes that will hold the top of the bracket in place. Here we give you the rundown of where you will need to pop the factory caps out and where the U-clips will need to go. Now let's get the U-clips in place. These are a little tricky, but you wanna make sure that the nipple of the clip is on the inside of the factory hole. It will click right into place. I grab a couple buddies for this part as unfortunately I can't hold the steps up myself and also line them up and tighten them down. First, you want to drop a bolt with a washer down where the steps line right up on the pinch weld. Grab another washer and the nut and you can tighten it all up. Here we went ahead and busted out the tool so we knew that everything would be secure. For the top of the bracket, you will just need a bolt and a washer, thread it into the nipple of the U-clip, and make sure you really tighten it down. To save a little bit of time, we only show you how to tighten down one bracket. You will do this for the other three brackets the same way, really making sure you get them secure and tight. Go ahead and go over both the brackets and the steps themselves and really make sure that all of the bolts are tightened down. 
All right, now that we have these installed on the truck, you can really see how awesome they are. A few notes to remember about the installation process. You're gonna need a couple tools. We do recommend that you have a buddy or two around for when you're holding the steps up. And please make sure that you tighten down everything, especially the brackets, because as you remember, we just originally hand tighten those. One thing to note is that we also did not utilize a lift for this install, so it's super DIY. Grab a buddy or two, a couple cold ones, head on out to your garage and you'll get these done no problem. For this truck, it is leveled, so we had no problem getting up underneath there, but for you lifted truck guys, this will be a breeze. If you guys like this video, make sure you subscribe to stay up to date on new products, giveaways, and installation videos. And if you have any questions about the ICI Magnum RT Step Bars or anything else we offer, give us a call or check out MidwestAftermarket.com.